friends, I'm Jess. Welcome to the Hex Library, where I post reading, writing, book, and planner related content a couple of times a week. Today is going to be my walkthrough of my October planner setup. First, as always, we start with a flip through of my previous month. So this is our September planner setup. Uh, as you can tell, I talked about it in the last month's video and I never went in and wrote September in here anywhere. So, you know, it's fine. It's fine. Um, there are definitely plans in here that never happened, but I did use a lot of this as usual. Uh, when we get into my weeklies, it's a little sketchy here and there. Definitely enjoying the newer setup. I do still really like this version. And I will go back to this. Um, I will use this again in the future, but I am at this current moment really liking this setup um, of having a page with all of my events and like daily tasks versus things that need to be done, but can be done any day that week um, versus these where it's just events and then tasks on every day, but then it doesn't always get done. So then it'll get moved to a different day. Um, I'm liking this version a little better. I did, for the most part, use my weeklies pretty well, um, except for this week was not the most, but this week I was house sitting. But I do like being able to have like this decoration box at the bottom of every week also, um, doing my decorating. Um, I did swap these sides because this was originally the way that I wanted to do it, um, but just had done it wrong in the first month, the first week that I did it and then followed on with that trend. Um, so I did swap it back at some point. Um, but yeah, enjoying this setup and then this is next week. So not really a lot going on in here yet because haven't got to this yet. So, um, today is technically Sunday the 24th. So we're still over here. And then we get into my reading section of the planner. Used a lot of this, read a lot of books this month. Um, there's a lot of X's on here if you look in real close. Hauled a good number of books, didn't really do any backlist arcs, did read some new releases. Uh, books that I've read, books that I've unhauled, uh, Summer Scare Readathon, which is my readathon uh, that I did from the 1st through the 10th. I did really well at that. And then I am currently doing the Pick Pongathon. I've made this two pages because I wasn't sure um, what I was really going to get into for the Pick Pongathon. But so far, I've really only needed this space, so I may go back in and just decorate this pretty or do some kind of like memory keeping for the month or something just to fill out this extra space. Um, but I am currently reading Title, which is my last book for the Pig Pongathon. I also read some other things that were not on the list so far. So that gets us into ta -da, October. And look, I actually wrote in the month for October. Go me. I would like a raise. Um, we've got some events on here already. We've got the first week is my writing retreat week. Uh, technically, it's Sunday to Friday, not Sunday to Saturday, but some people will still be here on Saturday, so we're going with that. Sunday to Saturday, um, I've got my best friend's birthday. We're planning on going to the Renaissance Festival that weekend. And then also Storyteller's Hearth Weekend Relay is in here. So I've got some things in there already. Um, these stickers are from Planning with Kay, and these are her Hocus Pocus set. I have probably six copies of this set of stickers because I use them pretty much every October. I do have some other things that I've added in um, and I'll show you those when we get to them. Um, oh look, we got to them. Again, weekly setup with spaces for the events. These daily stickers are again from the Hocus Pocus set from Planning with Kay. I've got a space for weekly tasks, hexed tasks, which are for hex library, hexed hourglass, and hexed homestead which hasn't started yet, but will in the future. So it's got space there. Uh, menu ideas is where I put anything that I know I've got the stuff to make for for the week. Um, so it's not necessarily like this is what I'm gonna eat this week. It's this is what I have everything in the house of that I can make without having to go to the grocery store. And then a STH tasks, which is Storyteller's Hearth tasks. Um, this one is not fully decorated, but I pulled the sticker off when I was decorating my monthly and then ended up not using it because of the way that it fit and I also think that it's upside down. The bat should be the other way because the things are... listen. Now will it stick? Yeah, who knows. There we go, that makes more sense. Anywho, 
This is, I believe, part of this roll. These are from the washi tape shop. Um, and this is washi tape, but it's actually individual stickers. Um, this set is no longer available on their website, but they do have some other um, Halloween tapes that are still available, new ones for this year. Um, but these ones are last year's tapes. I think I went ahead and filled out all of my monthly. I did, again, these are from Planning with K, Planning with K, Planning with K. And then my reading planner section, which I did not even put anything in here that says it's the reading planner section, but at this point, I think we all know what it is. There's a few stickers in here from Planning with K, but most of these are from the washi tape shop. And I've got place for new releases, backlist arcs, a haul, a TBR, group and challenge TBR. Um, I have filled out my 40 books that are possibilities for the 31 books of October. Um, this will be the next video that we go over. So if you don't want to, you know, look in real close, that's okay because we're going to have a whole video going over these 40 books. Uh, then the books that I've read and then any DNFs. And then back here, I have nothing. There's some readathons and stuff going on and I wasn't sure if I was going to do any of them. So I have left myself some space to do things. If I so choose, will I do any anything for the write-a-thon I don't know if I do it'll end up in here I, I don't know so that is what I have going on for October and my setup for the month if you guys have any questions about anything that you've seen in here let me know I would be happy to answer those for you if you made it this far in the video leave me a snake emoji in the comments down below and that is all I have for today I will see you guys next time Bye.